I'm Bob Ross. Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Carly, and today I'm going to be attempting to do a Bob Ross painting tutorial. I haven't painted since oh, I was a kid. It's been so long, so this is probably going to be terrible, but let's give it a go. And with that, we'll just take off and we'll have a super time. Start today, I think, with some nice shapes. Jesus. That is quick. I'm just bouncing some nice little... Oh, mine's a lot darker. Make a little round circle patterns here. Just sort of wind it up, blend it together. Allow it to blend clouds. This is a great way to make clouds for seascape paintings. Maybe this one will be still. Oh my god. These lines could be basically straight across here. Because as you know, still water is always flat. Always oh my god. Yeah, that light area here, it'll remain in there. I didn't leave a wide area. Okay. Now we call for excess. <laughs> and just beat the devil out of it. This is where you take out all your frustrations and hostilities and... Oh, yes. Yes, queen! Fan brush. This is a really bad, cheap... Pinkish glow what? What did you do? It won't watch. Just enough. To... Just enough, a little bit more. There we well, just... go. This is pink! Oh, it's... <laughs> won't watch. Don't won't watch. Okay, let's go up here. Now we gotta make big decisions. I did much. I did much. We'll just use this brush and decide where our little clouds will leave us this a little bit very soon. You can enjoy the freedom of it. close to the top, but I'm trying not to touch it at this point. Very close. I need more water. Um, what? Black? A little bit of blue. Using a very firm pressure, just literally push this right into the fabric. How are you doing that? I don't want, I don't want a lot of mounts today. That's about all we need. Ah! And the two inch brush, you want to grab the of words and stuff when you're painting. It'll help you, it'll help your hand go much more gentle. Will it? Shoot, maybe this one right here. I don't know. How are you this good? Make a decision. Maybe it just sort of wraps this old mountain up. We'll take two inch brush <laughs> and just blend it together. This is a super way of making it has a good time all day. Now that My mountain doesn't look like it's having a good time all day. I don't have a green paint. I have every color but green. And I'm painting scenery. That is stupid of me. Wow, I'm not good at this. How does his look so good? And just tap the base of it. You can tap quite firmly. You can probably hear how, how hard I'm hitting the canvas here. And then very lightly, just lift it up a little. You don't want just a flat old painting. If you go at an angle like this, it won't look right. See, even there, it doesn't look right. We don't make mistakes here. We just have happy accidents. But you learn to use anything. We don't have mistakes here. We just have happy accidents. My whole painting's a happy accident. Friends are so important. This is why. Look at my brush. All right. It's a bad brush. But just use this big brush. Ready to have some fun? No. If you've painted with me before, you know. I don't have a big brush. The trees. He's a live here. Let's just push in some, push in some nice, and let it go. Darker, darker, darker as you work down toward the base of the tree, though. Darker, darker. Ah! He must win! None of my paints did what his paints did! A beautiful painting that even a beginner can do with ease. <laughs> Why are you lying? Okay, so here's my finished painting. Look at it from a distance only because up close she is a mess. <laughs> 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 
What is this? Holy guacamole, she is not doing well. She's, she's not doing well. No, oh, oh my god. Thanks, Bob Ross. You are a wonderful, happy man. And, oh god. I wish I could paint like you because I clearly cannot. But, yeah, that is my attempt at following a Bob Ross painting tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I put out new videos every week. Subscribe and hit that notification bell if you'd like to see more. And I'll see you next time. Bye. See me a fun in the middle of every dark room. She fills her nose up a little right on the bus.